Hi, I'm Heather Crower from The Wave, and we are here at the amazing and stunning Miners Museum. And uh, we are going to do the simulator. I'm going to go talk with Mary Pat Mumbercad, and we're going to find out all kinds of stuff that they're having at the museum once it opens. Uh, and we're lucky enough to get a little sneak peek of this simulator that they have that's brand new. And uh, we're going to let you know how it goes. I'm excited. So this, this guy clearly was ahead of his time with the masks. Um, little <laughs> do we know that we would be wearing them, but he is, you know, and, and I, I've been to the Monty's Museum a couple times, uh, a few times in my life, and uh, they always talk about all the gear that they had to wear and uh, what they had to do in case anything happened. Um, that was a very real part of mining. So I'm guessing that this guy is showing off his, uh, his mining fashion. We should get you into it. Right. Get you dressed um, up. I think, that, I think that'd be a good look. Why, so you can't see my face? Not saying anything. So I'm here with Mary Pat Mumbercat, who has been working very hard along with her crew and everybody else. Um, and Mary Pat, this is kind of the kickoff to our summer season, so we wanted to really focus on the Miners Museum. And you guys have a new exhibit, which is a simulator. And I'm just wondering if you could tell me a little bit how that came to be. I know it was kind of a process to get going. Uh, and yeah, and just, just how, it, how it happened, and here we are. Well, it all started back in 2017, and that was when, remember before then, the museum was falling apart. Yes. The holes in the roof, there was rain coming in, we, we were on the bucket brigade. Yeah. Well, we got some funding to, to make that all happen, and we got a little bit extra to sort of say, okay, once the building is all shored up, where would we like to go? Yeah. And so we worked really hard with a... a, a, a a contractor, Aldrich Pears company, and we created a strategic plan which would be about our interpretive renewal program. And one of the things on the top of that list was a simulator, an orientation room that would sort of lead you into the simulator. So we decided, got at, right after that 2017, we decided, okay, let's go looking for money and make this happen. And we found money in uh, 2018. So we were planning on having a year building this and then in 2019 opening it up. And uh, it got a few, a few delays. Everything construction always takes longer than nice. you think it's going to take. And then we were right on track to open for 2020 when COVID hit. <laughs> it was all supposed to be done by March 31st, 2020. Mm -hmm. but. Um, I think it was March 15th when the border started shutting right. down and my crew was from New Brunswick and BC and they had to get out of town. Yeah. So a year later, after all kinds of paperwork and exemptions and self-isolations, um, we, we got together again and finished the simulator. And I must say, it's, it's better than I expected. So what is the simulator about? What exactly is it taking uh, people that visit to? What, where are we going when we enter the simulator? Okay, first off, you enter the, the orientation room. In the orientation room, you get to meet uh, a retired miner, Angus. And Angus will tell you about the history of mining in Cape Breton and also a little bit about his life. And his wife will come on and tell you a little bit about her life. And then Angus will lead you into the virtual mine tour. And in the mine tour, you'll sit in a rake car and you'll go underground with Angus and you'll, it'll be three er eras of coal mining, the turn of the century, the, not, both the 1920s or 30s, and then later into the 1960s or 70s. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's, it's mining through the ages and it's a fascinating look at our Cape Breton history. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 So this is the Wash House Orientation Room. So have a seat and I will start her up for you. 
So we just did the orientation and I promise you, I just watched a video and I have goosebumps from it. And that's just the first part of it. Right now we're actually in the simulator room, right? Yes, yeah, this is a simulator room. So that you're right, the orientation room sets you up for this. This is the real experience. <sighs> this will this will blow you away. I, I the video for you. <laughs> I, I like, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. This is absolutely incredible. I can't wait for people to come in and see this. I mean, we've been, this has been four years in the making. So I'm so excited to see people's faces and reactions. I can't wait. Absolutely. Absolutely. Me too. I can't wait for my reaction. <laughs> I'm so excited. Let's get to it then. Okay. Of course. <laughs> so we just finished um, the the simulator and uh, I can I can only speak for myself but I think Chad as well it was stunning it's something that you can never experience and I know that it's unique to this museum and there's none else around um, it is absolutely incredible and they do have like this package where you start at the orientation and then you go to the simulator and then you actually do the mine underground which I've done before and I think the three of them combined to give you an amazing picture of the life that uh, the miners lived and how you know how our culture is based on that history and um, it's all happening at the Miners Museum in Glace Bay. Even if you have been here before, you have to come check this out. I promise you, you will not be disappointed. There's so much going on anyway, but this is an absolute showstopper. Showstopper. So, Mary Pat, uh, congratulations for one thing. Like, I know you're proud of it, as you should be. Uh, it's absolutely amazing, and, and we just want to take the time to thank you for letting us do this. Oh, thanks for coming. It's, I just love Get, see people's reactions. Yeah, to it. It, yeah, yeah. It is. It is. It is. Uh, it's, it's unique to us. A hundred percent. And I was. I wiped my tears away before I even started this video. Um, but absolutely, absolutely. We're we're so excited. This is a gem. This is an absolute gem of our history. So thanks again, Mary Pat, and we'll see you at the Miners Museum. Thank you.